Loose Moose in a nutshell. Loose Moose was formed by me and Mel Tonkin. Mm -hmm. Mel Tonkin was a local vet who wanted to be an actor and was very good. Ah, he was a vet, right? A vet, yeah. animal doctor. Yeah. Uh, full of good ideas that he couldn't do. Hmm. You can get, in America you can, you can buy all sorts of costumes, you can dress the receptions up as mice and things. What happens when you're being a cat to the vet? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Got a giant mouse sitting at a typewriter. <laughs> I mean, well, they wouldn't let him do it because, you know, they made him take his sign down that had nice bunnies on. Right. Because you're not supposed to advertise like that. Ah. Anyway, Mel was lively. And I think of Edgar, he was the best estrogen, as good as any estrogen in God I've ever seen. And did the great speech wonderfully, and most actors screwed up. Derek Flores screwed up amazingly. <laughs> he wanted to make it the message of the play. Oh. Uh, anyway, I'd, 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 gone, I'd done God at least five times. Yeah. I, I wouldn't mind doing another one. I would love to see that. There was some, I could, I mean, there was some plan to do it at a royal court with me and the Improbable Theatre Company. Would be amazing. But the, the court had just done a Beckett season, so they decided it was they couldn't become the Beckett Theatre. When but you're I 90, like, we'll send you over to Phelan, McDermott. And well, we don't have to do it at the Royal Court. We can do it somewhere <laughs> we else. We can do it here. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, I started moves. with that. And we used to do four plays a year, long, full-length plays. We used yeah. to do six children plays. Oh, well, we took our own theatre space. And as we moved, the Conservative government had an idea I approve of. They gave you money in relation to how many ticket seats you sold. And as we always, every seat was always full in those days, we would have had a big grant. Mm -hmm. But they froze all the grants as we moved in. And you didn't just move into any old theatre space. We moved into the best theatre in Calgary, because it wasn't, it wasn't art. It was a cattle auction house. When, well, I can't understand cattle. You have to see the whole animal. So you could, oh, we raised the stage up, I think, as, as well. But you had to see. Mm -hmm. um, so I don't, I, I, this seems impossible, but when they built this, complex downtown, there were some seats that couldn't see the stage. <laughs> and they were yeah. saying, a theatre needs a running in period, because they didn't want to criticise the architect. Mm -hmm. But if some seats can't see the stage, that is a definite error. Yes. Yeah. But I'm not sure I read that in the newspapers. Mm -hmm.